was 20 years old, I'd never been to Europe. I had romantic images uh, of what it was like. And so I drew into that some of the, like the British museums on there, and Westminster. And that's also comes out of this experimentation. What happened when I jiggled these rules? What, what, are, what are these panels going to look like? I, I'm constantly, there's a whole kind of um, uh, system of re, re coloring the palette. Every morning I mix, I add, put two paints that are near each other together and mix them up. And so the, the, there's a continuous palette, continu continuum of color. It's, oh, wow. A 23. Oh, I have three numbered the cards because I want to figure it out. 23. I move down 23 panels in stack, pull out that one, program there. And, and if I just chuck along and crank that out, it's like a computer spitting out, but it's all done by hand, and so it winds up looking like that. And it's a 16 of hearts. Um, not that hearts count these days, but well, in the way they do. Uh, and <laughs> everything counts. And the panel that came up in the draw was this one. And all of this is background. These are copies. This is a fourth generation panel, and this also four, which means there are three earlier versions of these two panels. Every panel has a, well, I refer to it as the center. It's not at the center of the panel. It's a little crosshair that is my starting point for anything that happens on that panel. And I tell them, now it's part of the mythology that those are invisible fence lines. <laughs> and that this is a human zoo. It's a map, a plan for a human zoo. And when you're first there, you only get to operate within that little ring. Um, and the rings. If it goes into the collage these days, I want to be related to me or my family or my history in some way. And so I don't take external stuff so much. If there's a pretzel box, it's pretzels I've eaten or you know, beer that I've drunk or pasta that I've had. When I went into the Frankfurt School, I didn't, I, I, I don't think I did anything. I was just there. The kids did it all. And that's really things like with Christine's classes, being around idealistic young farmers who want to grow food. It's, as I'm getting older, I, I want to, I want to feel that what's going on in our planet is the right kind of stuff. And if I'm around young people, like Tiffany and Kristen and the other students here and the kids at Interlock, and I, I'll be able to go out knowing that the place is in good hands.